Now I think everyone with a modicum of comedic leanings has been busting a rib or two at the reaction of game devs to the sheer sky-shattering success and scope of Baldur's Gate 3. And while I have not played the pan-gendered furry simulator in question, yet, I find the reaction hell damn hilarious. Call me old-fashioned, but I think that telling people that you have an adversity to turning out quality games is not exactly the soundest of marketing strategies. But on the less mentally deficient side of things, I've noticed a slow return and uptick in recent years of actual RPGs in development, from Larian's recent success to Starfield actually having the return of RPG elements not seen since Daggerfall. Speaking of which, the creators of said opus are busy with a spiritual successor in the form of the Wayward Realms. And while I am trepidatious due to some of what I have seen, this could reignite the dead fires of creativity and bring us back to having honest-to-goodness open-world sandbox RPGs that don't suck. And it's not like RPGs don't sell. Baldur's Gate is proof of that, I think. And I think that this is an invitation to... Other developers, the ones with eyes to see, that is, to try and create more RPGs, and that's good for everyone, especially if they are good, because the customer benefits from more choices, and it will drive the developers to get creative and actually take risks again. But with that, I turn it over to you. Tell me what you think down below. This has been Pete, the Heretical Nerd, signing off.